Police are investigating a shooting that happened overnight that sent four people to the hospital. It happened on the near north side just after 2 a.m. and two of the victims are teenage boys. Brona Tumulty is live now with the latest on this story. Brona. Good evening, guys. Yeah, we're here at the intersection of Locust and North Orleans. You can see behind me the car wash is partially boarded up where the glass was shot out overnight. And over on this side of the street, the glass is actually getting replaced right now at the Niche 905 apartment complex. Now, in the middle of all of this, four people were shot, and all that commotion outside woke up quite a few of the neighbors. Started off with what could only be automatic fire, uh, really quick. Aaron Goggin was one of the people overnight who heard gunfire going off in his neighborhood. Well, it's not something you want to wake up to. It's disconcerting. Um, it's sad that it happens anywhere. Those shots rang out after 2 a.m. near the corner of Locust and North Orleans on the near north side. Bullets seemingly strike in a nearby car wash and the Niche 905 apartment complex. Sometimes people say that it sounds a little bit like fireworks, but it doesn't. It's a lot sharper than that. But it's unclear who exactly was shooting. Police say the shots were possibly fired by the occupant of a red Dodge Charger at someone in a grey sedan. Four people were struck in all, but it seems none of them were the intended targets. Two of the victims were 15-year-old boys standing on the sidewalk. Both were taken to Lurie's and are expected to be OK. A rideshare driver who was waiting on some passengers was also hit, but is also said to be doing well. Uh, a lot of shots, dozens of shots. Woke me up, I got out of bed, and I came and looked off the balcony and I saw the, the white Prius right up there. That uh, person was shot in the hand, the driver. Another resident here named David says whoever was in the offending vehicle also didn't immediately speed off. The car just did a slow roll and drove right on by and just kind of kept doing a slow roll down the street. Didn't seem to be in a hurry to get away from what they had done. A fourth victim was later found at Balbo and Lakeshore Drive. He's 20 years old, was shot in the torso, and at last check, was in serious condition. We need to pray for our city. We need to pray for the people involved in this. And it's really the only hope. Now, our cameras were rolling overnight as a couple of people were placed in the back of a squad car. Neither were handcuffed and we're told nobody is currently in custody. So far this year, almost 3,500 people have been shot across Chicago. We're live in the near north side. Brona Tumulty, WGN News.